you, as a network engineer, need to learn Linux. Now you may ask why, so let's look at some reasons. The first reason is that a lot of modern network operating systems are based on Linux. Some use a custom command line interface, or CLI, which means that they don't look like Linux, but they in actual fact run on Linux. And some network operating systems allow you to drop down into a Linux shell. Some are just pure Linux. Here are three examples. We have a Nexus 9000V. So show version. Notice this is a Nexus operating system switch, 9000. Here's an Arista EOS switch. And here's a Cumulus switch. These three switches are running in GNS3. So through the CLI of the Nexus 9000, we see our typical Cisco commands, such as configure terminal. But we can also use this command, run, and run a bash shell. Notice this is Linux, so question mark doesn't work, like it works in the Cisco CLI. But Linux commands do work here, such as working out which directory are we in. So which working directory are we in? Who am I? Which files are available here? Some commands are not supported, but notice commands such as ifconfig are supported. So ifconfig more. There are interfaces per typical Linux commands. Here's vi. Clear. Now if I type exit, I'm back in my Cisco shell. So again, we can run commands such as show and show various commands. So we can run various show commands as we would normally. But notice if we type run bash again, we are in a Linux shell. Exit takes me back to the Cisco shell, run bash, a Linux shell, type Python here, and we are now running a Python interpreter. Back on Linux, back on the Cisco CLI. Same is true in Arista. In Arista, this is an Arista CLI. So commands such as show IP interface brief work or show run. There's the running config of the Arista switch. Very similar to what we would do on Cisco, show run to see the running config of a Cisco device. But on Arista, we simply type bash. And notice we are now in the Linux shell. LS, PWD, who am I? Look at processes. Make a directory, ls, run python, so very similar to the Cisco environment, exit takes me back to the Arista shell, bash takes me directly to the Linux shell, vi, there's vi, clear, ifconfig, and so forth. So here are two switches from two vendors that allow us to run Linux commands directly on the switch. Now Cumulus Linux gives us direct access to the Linux shell. Cumulus also have their own CLI type interface, but by default you're straight into Linux. So PWD, VI, clear, ifconfig, processes, etc etc so the first reason to learn linux is a lot of network operating systems run linux or are based on linux you may or may not have access to the linux shell that depends on the vendor and the operating system so i hope that's answered the question for a lot of you and i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please like it and please subscribe to my youtube channel I want to wish you all the very best.